Hello everyone and welcome back to the Romania campaign in Napoleon Total War. It is a modded Napoleon Total War with the Total Factions mod as well as the Balkan mod. Which allows us to have all sorts of cool units and play as Romania. Today we're going to actually attack the Ottomans. I was th uh, thinking between the two options of attacking them south at Istanbul or northeast at Yash. And although both both options are kind of cool, like you know they they would work. Uh, this probably it's probably gonna take longer to get to Istanbul and be more fights where they're a bit tougher. Uh, and I would need to make sure that my home is protected. If I attack at Yash, I can reach there in one turn. And what happens is I'll have this. I'll get more income since right now I'm barely making any money because of the army I built. So I'll get more income for having Yash, and then I'll c be able to come back and defend Bucharest and the town of whatever, Craiova over here, from uh, any Ottomans that could come in. And hopefully be able to push back and then take out the Ottomans at Istanbul and, at the, uh, and finally at um, Belgrade there. So yeah. Um, that's going to be the plan today, is at least to take this one city, Yash over there. We're, we're, we're still recruiting uh, a cannon and the line infantry, and we could go ahead with the army we have here, because that would be enough to take Yash, I believe, because they shouldn't have that much um, military there, or they wouldn't be that highly advanced either. And then, I only have to make sure I have a few units sitting back to defend so let's see are you guys any useful treasury administration I already have treasury from this guy and you have nothing so we'll, we'll keep you around maybe uh, maybe I can jughead with this happiness <clears throat> well I could move this guy over there put the treasury guy in Let's let's see. Let's do that. I'll move this guy here, uh, so that will get us better upkeep and recruitment cost. And let's put these guys in. See if they get any updates, any bonuses. This guy got some kind of bonus. What are you? Nothing. He just went. Okay. He went to four star because he's got the plus two treasury. Okay. He can stay. He's fine there. Now we have a bit more. Well, we had the same wealth bonuses with this guy over there, but anyway, that's about it. Uh, so the other uh, the other bonus to me taking Moldova first is that then I can train, uh, sorry, trade with the Russians. They're in indifferent right now, but I should be able to train trade with them, and maybe even these guys here, uh, which is supposed to be Serbia, which. The game placed it in the wrong placed the nation in the wrong spot when it started. It's the same with uh, <laughs> actual Tsara Moldova that says that says it correctly. It was supposed to be here at Moldova, but uh, I don't know what happened. The mod is not perfect, but I'm okay with that. I'll just take this for myself and I have to unite Romania after all, right? That was that's our main main focus is to unite our provinces have a nice big country and then push against all the enemies that would rise against us that's the plan i do thank you guys for tuning in and i thank you for all the support and reaction for the last uh, episode the first video of this series um you guys oh. let's turn those off you guys uh, responded well and showed support so i i like that Let's see, we have one more turn. We'll stay one more turn and then go in. Who are you? John Ostalsov. 29 with no particular traits. That's okay. We don't really need him anywhere. Uh, we could use a better head of state. But, um, I mean, I could put this guy here. That doesn't do anything. I could put this guy up there. 
Probably doesn't do much. Diplomatic relations is plus one and wealth. And that's, not, that's not bad. It's not bad. But we'll keep the um, upkeep cost portion. Okay, let's end one more turn with that button. And then it is to war, my brothers. To war indeed. Yep. Indeed, indeed, indeed. I think I'll leave back just the one um, general. Leave back one general, which. Let's see. This guy. I'll leave back this guy, because this guy has better uh, movement range. And home. City um, Bucharest will have the artillery next turn. So I could leave. I could leave a foot. Leave a foot artillery. A foot place. Here's what I'll do. I'll leave one of these guys back. Yeah. Okay. We will declare war. Just like that. We're not even gonna ask him. Hey, would you like to? You know, maybe fight. No. We're just gonna do it. They have some units there, but looks like it is in our favor. They have a 9 pound foot artillery. Janissaries, musketeers. These guys have longer range, so we'll have to watch for those guys. Everyone else is militia, mob. Okay, so I should be able to outmaneuver them. Let's fight. Yeah. We are the attacking. Force and is the Battle of Yash in 1805, month of May, I believe. It's what is it? Is it past the month of May? Anyway, early, early summer. Good stuff. We will take the Jaegers and where is the these guys? Brigade, Engineer Brigade, and we'll put them on the side. I think that Engineer Brigade doesn't go into loose formation like these guys do light infantry behavior for you that should be a good setup then we have a big main line I, I think I'll keep them in the woods and we'll spread them out we'll spread them out thin we'll spread them out thin I want to be able to outmaneuver these guys uh, somehow okay and then we'll have our cav on this side. Try to go in. Uh, these guys can dismount and fire their weapons. Otherwise they'll just charge in. So I'll probably use them as cav for a while. And if I need to fire their weapons, then I will. Alright, and the general, sit in the woods. Turn those guys off. I keep forgetting to do that. Just push you guys up here. I'm gonna run you forward a bit, although you don't want to be running forward, but I feel like I need to. So I can get into position before they do. Whatever position they're gonna take. We need to get there. I think this is a good spot in the brush in the brush here in the in the bushes. Be able to Alright, be able to not take as much damage. They're probably gonna charge their horsemen in, so I have to be wary of that. Uh, we're gonna pretend like we're running away. Uh, but then we're gonna counter charge. Actually, why not? Let's just let's just doggy doggy fight with them a little bit. Okay, never mind. Yeah, that was stupid. Yeah, okay, yeah. I took a charge. Yeah, that was good. That was that was brilliant. Why didn't you fight? There we go. That that will teach you.
Okay, well, that was all bad. That's all bad. They're gonna fight that out. Uh, you guys... You guys have to take on these guys. Alright, are we in range here? No. Come on. Take him out. Okay, we're gonna move forward a little bit. Never mind. Uh, stop and fire. <laughs> With what? What could possibly be attacking us? Alright, so that's in the woods, not really good. Can probably get an advantage here in a second. How are you guys doing? Alright, that's that's looking good. This is not good. Run into a better position, my friends. Forward. Hussars. Alright, what do we need to rally? What, what do we gotta do? Come on, buddy. This could go bad. This could go bad. We have a lot of peasant levy and stuff. And our cab went in. These guys are sitting strong, actually. Fight the peasant levy! What are you guys doing, man? Our men are running oh yeah? Oh, those are... Not, not what I wanted. Come back! Alright. Uh... Just a lot of micromanaging here. It is getting pretty weird. Like, I'm not sure what the AI is doing. Fire. Need to be in. Okay, run. Okay, we need to move our cab out of there. Come on, buddies. Run for your lives. General's bodyguard. These guys are gonna chase me? No. Move forward. Okay, we have 
make the move. No, you're fine. Move you guys behind. I know I have more units. How are you guys doing? Am I gonna lose these dragoons? Let's pull them out. Come on. Move forward, they're moving. Okay, how about you guys move forward here? I'll go after those guys. Out of box formation. Okay, uh, really want like a uh, fire in advance. Oh, yeah? Phew, you guys? Alright, come back. Rally! I think I need to bring my general behind the line. We can do it. We can do it. Okay, you guys can go out of box formation. Make it quick. Fire! Let's move forward. Why are these guys not dead? Look at the... We've been shooting at that thing for a while and they're not dead. Okay. How are we doing here? an eye on that. These guys will fire on them, keep them busy. Cool, I think we're doing okay now. We should have this, have this in the bag. You guys can push forward. They're all breaking. Charge. Okay, move forward with you. What are you guys doing? Hmm. Seriously, what are you doing? Right here. <laughs> okay, let's give him one big blow back here. I'm gonna look at it. They just don't give up very easy, do they? They've all given up, and once this general hits this unit, it should be finished with. Yeah! And there's one more. Oh, no, I think they all broke. End battle! 
Heroic victory, sweet. That was heroic, my friends. <laughs> yeah. Oh my goodness, I need to make make her shut up. Okay, we can definitely... Uh, we don't need to loot. We're just going to occupy because this extra wealth here won't get us instant money, but it will keep our people happier and it will make us more money uh, over time. So, that's that. What is this? Barracks? We have to... We have to repair it. And then we'll be able to change it into something. Let's see, we can... Uh, we get the same, about the same thing. About the same thing as down here. I don't think we're getting... Yeah, we're getting the same thing. Jaegers, I mean... Jaegers are there. We got uh, Hussars, the Red Dragoons, so on. How is the happiness here? Uh, I guess I suppose I can go here. Have I not turned you guys off? Alright. So they're slightly unhappy. I could exempt them from tax. That'll make them happier. Uh, and with that, I can probably move some of the army back. Uh, maybe, maybe I like clear these, but I can't now because of, well, they don't have any more movement points. Uh, how many usually one, okay, one unit moving about. I could, oh, let's do that, let's, let's be safe, move one unit into here. Like that. Uh, so then they can't just come and raid me with one unit. Uh, they won't be able to get there unless they pass by Bucharest. And I have... Well, I just have my general. And then I'll bring units down. Let's see if we can trade with anyone else. Let's see. These guys will probably trade. Quest trade agreement. Please do. Yes. Thank you. And how about Russia? Yes, you will trade. I think that was I think that was a good good option. Good option there. We don't have any sea access. Oh look, we can put a farm. We already have farms. We can make better farms. And then this is a commerce center. That's cool. What else could it could there be? Merchant house. I guess I should look at the building browser. Okay, in the city we can have a uh, cannon, theater, or a tax office. I might switch to that. Just so I can enable some of those research researches. Blah. And I think it'll get better... Uh, Population, peace, whatever. What's the word? <laughs> Happiness. Because uh, we're already we already have a full barracks down in Bucharest, cannons as well. We don't have a museum. Hmm. We could do a museum. No, I think I'll I think I'll hold off on the museum and go with the magistrate tax office stuff. Maybe I'll put the museum somewhere else. Right. Okay. Uh, let's end the turn to see what happens. I haven't checked to see how much money I make now. From uh, trading with two more nations. But I'm curious to see if the Ottomans react right away. If they don't react right away, then I'll, that's perfect. Because I have time to move my forces back into Bucharest. And then push on their own land. Like they're just going to move by. Okay. Unit recruiting. We have cannons. We constructed roads. Awesome. 
All right, so why don't we move just about everyone, really? Income. We're making 700. 700. Uh, hmm. Maybe I'll get some militia for Yash. Get some militia. These guys won't cost anything when they're inside the town, I believe. Doesn't say that here. Yeah, yeah. Uh, when Ingers and are highly effective. Okay, they just they just maintain public order really well, but I think they also cost less or nothing. So we'll get a couple of militias for here. And yeah. How about we wait one more turn and then switch to the Magistrate. It's too bad it doesn't start with... I guess it does start. Magistrate is... Not there. Uh, yeah, second one. Just like, okay. So it's on the same level. That's cool. I like that. I do like that. We're gonna move our forces though. We're gonna move them back here. They'll still replenish. And I believe it will just be a little bit of a um, happiness problem. But I have exempt, exempted them from tax. If I charge them tax, then that will make them a slightly unhappier. And trade. There we are. We're making uh, most from Russia and then a bit from Serbia and Hungary. Cool stuff. Okay. Uh, I think I'll leave it at that. Maybe... Uh, I didn't lose my who's my light dragoon, so that's really cool. Maybe I'll actually leave this line infantry here and move with what I have down more. I could also recruit maybe a couple more units. Do I have any cool ministers? The answer is no, especially the <laughs> morally impaired fol folk over here person. Yay, we have pretty much good ministers, except for I do want a better head of state. Uh, so if someone comes up that's uh, better at justice, for example, we can move this guy to head of state. So that would be, that would be quite nice, wouldn't it? Thank you for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed this episode. We do have Yash. The... Uh, the city called Yash and the area of Moldova and Basarabia. Look, what are the names of this town? Comrat, apparently. Comrat. And what's this? Uh, Kishino. That's pretty cool. There probably should be more towns. There should be more towns here. I hope they actually made it where more towns pop up. I'm not sure if they put that, mo that much um, into the mod to have these nations have a bit more more bone. I wish I had a fourth spot in the city, but I don't. Could use could use something else here. Besides just the small fort. It'd be nice if you just chose not to build the fort and build something else. Like you know what, I'm not gonna worry about the fort, I'm just gonna put a museum instead. I'll be attacked and people will be like, oh no, let's not fight, this is really cool. Probably not going to work. But anyway, next episode we're going to attack the Ottomans at Istanbul. We're just going to march down the road. Look how nicely placed this road is. We're just going to go down this road here. Probably damage their, their um, harbor and then go for the city. That's the plan. Hope you guys come back next time. Please do hit the like button and comment with your thoughts. Share this out with your friends. I'm sure they would enjoy it too if you have. Yeah, check out my channel and subscribe if you want to uh, keep be kept up to date with what I post. And that's about it. Have a nice day. Bye-bye.